Welcome back to ADHD Whiskey, my name is Matt. Today is another installment of which like knows what Matt likes. And you know what that means. I'm gonna sip two different glasses. One of them was chosen by Dan Like, the other chosen by his wonderful wife, Julie Like. And each of them think that they know what Matt likes. Yeah, <gasps> don't chew on the cord, you'll get zapped cook girl or boy or something. Tonight's challenge was a bourbon whiskey between 101 and 119 proof. It opens the door to so many different things. We ditched the Kentucky Trail glasses for Kinsey or Kenzie or Schlemsey glasses, whatever these are. I just wasn't getting a good nose off the Kentucky Trail glasses. One of them clockwise, one of them counterclockwise. Do you know how I do that? Because I have a PhD and stupidity. Glass one. Caramel, maybe a little red licorice. Little cherry. This smells great. This smells like a Twizzler pull and peel that was mated with Twizzler's nibs. It's Twizzler nibble peel. I don't know. A little bit of pepper, a little bit of red licorice. Cherry, strawberry, oh, raspberry for shout. It's like a it's like a fresh raspberry. Glass one smells great. Now let's smell glass two. Glass two note. Hmm. Interesting. This smells tropical, like hand lotion. I wonder if someone was wearing hand lotion. Could have been. Coconut. A little bit of pineapple. Smells like a tropical salad of tropical paradise. Is my nose broke? It might be. So strange. I don't know. All I do know is that we need to taste these to determine a winner. Glass number one down the hatch. Well, that's good. Oh, heck yes. Oh my goodness. Freaking delicious. What the heck is that? That is delicious Laffy Taffy blended inside of some sort of wonderful, slightly undercooked bread dough that I love faux show. It's so good. What in the world? Raspberries? It's like a red fruit cocktail of fruits and red, redness. It's red. Next glass. O-N-G, Onagai. This smells a little bit more oaky than the first. A little more oaky, a little bit more, a little bit more cherry, ludiny, a little bit more sweet candy cherry. Oh, good grief. Oh, heaven have mercy on me. That's freaking delicious. This is so damn good. They picked good ones. I think I have, a, I think I already have a winner, I think. I could be wrong, I gotta go back, gotta go back. I think what, the, what it boils down to here is whether or not I like the presence of oak more than the not presence of oak. I will show the camera my decision and then I will put the likes on camera and I will reveal it. It's my winner. Smoke wagon, uncut, unfiltered. 113.6. Okay, Matt, who won? My pick was last B. I don't want to play this game anymore. He doesn't know what he's talking about. This fucking sucks. <laughs> Definitely a conspiracy is happening here against me. I think those two have been in collusion and this is just stacked against me. I am the bigger fan of Matt's. I would like to remind everybody that I am the one that found Matt's channel. I subscribed to Matt's channel. I became a patron of Matt's long before Dan Like ever stepped into the picture. This is just way too easy. Uh, my pick was Bell Mead 12 year cast strength single barrel. Uh, it's 12 year MGP product. Um, I cheated a little bit because Matt just opened the bottle and told me how much he loved it. And on the last live, I gave him a little shit for picking it. And now I've drank it three days in a row. It's incredible. I knew I'd win with this one. Plus, Julie just sucks at this. I don't care what happens here. I'm still the bigger fan. Definitely. 
Matt doesn't know what he likes. That's obvious. I know what Matt likes. In fact, his name should be Matt Like. But I already have a child named Matt Like, so that wouldn't work. Now I don't know if I even want him in my family. <laughs>